Hey guys, it's my random, and yesterday I posted a video with an update on my channel status, and you saw these two origami swans, and I promised that I would make a swan tutorial and post it. So that's what I'm going to be doing right now, so let's jump right in. So I'm going to be using a 6 inch by 6 inch sheet of origami paper, color on one side, white on the other. For this tutorial, we're going to be starting with the white side up and turn it so that it looks like a diamond. Go ahead and bring the top point down to the bottom point and crease sharply. We're going to be starting out with a kite base and we will be using this in more tutorials in the future, so it's best to learn now. Go ahead and turn the paper so that the line is running from top to bottom and we're going to bring these two edges to the center crease we've just created. We want to get a nice point at the bottom of our sheet here. So we're going to go ahead and do this on both sides. And here's our kite base. It's called a kite base because it looks like a kite. So now we're going to flip over so that just a solid color is facing upwards towards us. Now we're going to be doing the same thing, bringing these two edges towards the center crease. And you might find that the flaps are going to lift up, but if you just hold the paper steady and firmly and crease sharply, it should not be a problem. Now, with the point facing away from you, bring the top point to the back bottom point. And you might see a little white on the chest of the swan. That's okay, it just means that your first crease, your first folds rather, were not directly to the center crease. Go ahead and rotate your model 90 degrees and fold completely in half. Go ahead and flatten out your model as needed. Now this part is a little bit tricky so just follow along with what I'm doing. You're going to slightly pinch the neck here and pull up a little bit until you get about a 45 or 50 degree angle. Then push down here to make a crease. Now we're going to just twist over the head of our swan and it should look just like that. Then you're going to unfold, turn, open up the neck, and push down slightly on those two creases you've just made, folding in half again on the beak. Go ahead and fold the entire head in half and pull up a little bit, flatten as needed, crease sharply, and there we go. There is our origami swan. You can make lots of swans for your family, friends. They, it is a very simple tutorial, a great, great little project if you have um, a couple minutes of spare time. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends and family. They'll love it as well. It's very simple and very enjoyable. Thank you for all the support you show my channel. Remember to check out other videos that I've posted, and like I promised, more videos are on the way. Thank you guys so much for watching, and have an awesome day.